And Anagaya is getting us more details on that story as well. Joining us from Bengaluru right now, getting in the excitement in the air. Anagaya, as far as students and everybody else is concerned, everybody is going to be glued to the television sets today to get a sense of how history really is made, isn't it? You know, Sneha, if you can just give me two, three minutes, I'd really like sure. to show you the wonderful work that the students of Orchids International School in Bangalore have done. So I have with me a bunch of 10 to 15 students who have put in the hard yards to make miniature models of Chandrayaan 3, right from LMV to, you know, to the rover Pragyan, to Lando module, to propulsion module. You know, they've made these wonderful little models. And, um, and you know, keep in mind, they had only two days in their hands to make such beautiful models. So let's go straight to Sana. You know, she's going to be heading this team and she has some words to talk about Chandrayaan 3. Sana, tell us what does Chandrayaan 3 mean to you and what do you know about this mission? So, well, Chandrayaan 3 was actually launched on 14th of July 2023 and the main purpose of this launch was to research more about the um, South Pole of the Moon okay. and the objectives of this launch were, it includes um, to uh, demonstrate a safe and soft landing and to um, uh, it's, it was for um, scientific research purposes and also to exhibit uh, rover mobility yeah. and um, the launch uh, no, the launch vehicle which yeah. is used here is actually the LMB um, 3 Mark IV yeah. but an LMB actually stands for um, lunar modular vehicle. You know, Sala, you seem to be knowing all the details on sport. So are you like a science geek and how interested are you in astronomy? Do you, you know, do you plan on venturing into this space when you grow up? Well, space is actually quite interesting, and I have thought of it as a career option, wow. but yes, but it's still there on the wait list. But What's your inspiration? Inspiration? Well, um, well, I forgot the name of this astronaut. Um, Chavla. Chavla? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I've always been inspired by her, so yeah. Lovely. All the best to you, Sana. Thank I you. also want to go to Manas. Manas, can you explain to our viewers about any one of these models that you have done and the significance of this in Chandrayaan 3? And most importantly, how you made these models? Uh, so we've done this model right here and this, yeah, this model over here. What is it's, this? this is the lander, the lander model. It's like a DIY lander model which we made up in two days. Okay. That is the solar panel. This is one of the main parts and there's a connector over here. Mm -hmm. And that is mainly the, the lander over here. This, this part is the orbiter and this is the lander with, you know, we can see the landing pads over there. And maybe that also contains the rover. And we've also made, uh, the few of have also made the rocket model over that one, that one right there, which also which consists of the propulsion model which will... Um, actually help deploy, help take the lander and the rover yeah, up to the right. lunar orbit yeah. and it will, after deploying the lander, uh, the propulsion model will actually stay in, remain in orbit yeah. because it also carries another experimental payload and that propulsion model along with the payload will have a mission life of about, of about three to six months. Superb, you've got all the details correct. You know, Manas, I also want to know from you, you know, since you know all these details by heart in your hand, what was the learning curve that you had while you were making these models? So obviously, while we were making these models, we had to have that a certain level of knowledge about yeah. the about the mission. So, uh, as in our team, we did research about the mission, and because uh, space is something that you know it's endless, and there are so many possibilities, so many fascinating right. things out there. It's not really that hard to you know right. get that interest you know, to get that. Right, you know, Sneha, this is a level of excitement that is there in the students. You know, they have put in the hard yards for the last two days making these beautiful models, and one of the students over here even made a miniature model. Oh, 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 over here, if I can just ask my camera person to show. Camera. Yeah, uh, can you yeah. explain about this? So this model I have done two days ago, it took somewhat one to two hours. So I did it in a pencil lid. So I took a 10B pencil, I have carved some one, two centimeters. You know, this was made, you know, from... All right, Anaga is getting us all of those details, a sense of what the students there clearly are saying.